welcome back to my channel it's your girl with the show back with another video in today's video i'm going to be doing a quick weave a half up half down quick weave so let's get into it all right y'all so i go ahead and use the got to be spray as well as the lace bond spray my favorite oil to moisturize my scalp some bobby pins edge wraps a little brush to apply product, two wig caps, and then this is the protective shield that you'll use the brush to apply with. And then the hair, organic hair, any hair that you guys would like. So as you can see, they are two different types of curls. Um, I was going for a fuller look, so that's why I did that. But I'm gonna hop into part of my hair off Pretty much, I'm gonna just go ahead and part the ponytail off um, just so it's out the way. all right so once i go ahead and part off the other side i go ahead and part my hair down the middle so i can start doing the cornrows for the back excuse my voice i have not been getting enough sleep and y'all i just i'm so tired So once I finish parting, I just section off both sides, as you can see the cornrow, and then I'll start to cornrow my hair all the way to the end. Now I try to make sure the cornrows are small because I want my hair to be flat and I don't want it to be like lumpy. So that's as small as I was gonna go. Honestly, I was not trying to be here all day. This is a quick weave for a reason, okay. So now i'm just gonna do the rest on the left side of my head i'm gonna go ahead and part section off and then curl my hair all the way to the end and just do that for the whole back part of my hair Y'all, at this moment, I was tired. <laughs> I was tired. And mind you, I only did the back part of my hair. Like, whew, Lord, I was tired. But yeah, there you go. I have like two more on the other side. I'm going to just go ahead and finish up really quickly. All right, y'all, so this is the final look of the back. Um, at this point, I will put oil in my hair, but I did not record me putting the oil in my hair. So, oil your scalp before you do the quick weave. <laughs> um, I go ahead and grab my wig caps. I am gonna be using two just because I've had horrible, horrible times where I will take my quick weave down and there's glue on my hair, so we're gonna use two wig caps today. Okay, y'all, let me tell you, let me tell you, this brush right here, I wish I got it the very first time I started doing these half up, half downs because this is a game changer. So I apply the protective shield on my hair where I need, you know, it to stay and protect my hair. And then with the brush, you just apply it and it's just, uh, it just, it's a smooth application. It's not messy. Like before I was applying this with my hands and y'all, it was so, so messy. And I know like y'all probably like, why would you apply with your hands? It's sticky. But listen, like it's a quick weave. Like I was not trying to, you know, like, I don't know. But yeah, go get this brush <laughs> if you're doing a quick weave. But um, yeah, I just go ahead and just apply a decent amount. Honestly, you're going to have to apply a f like a few layers um, just to make sure your hair is pretty protected because you will be using glue. 
but yeah after i apply a few layers i go ahead with my blow dryer making sure that it is completely dry before i apply the next layer All right, so we are gonna move on to the next wig cap. I'm gonna go ahead and put that over top. And honestly, I'm just trying to make sure my hair is pretty protected, um, you know, because I really don't want glue in my hair. So again, apply a decent amount of the protective shield, make sure it's covering. I did use the got to be spray and the lace bond um, just to make sure, just, you know, extra precautions, just to make sure nothing, you know, seeps through onto my natural hair. All right, y'all. So once that is completely dry, I double check, triple check, all of that. I got to make sure, um, I go ahead and just cut down the middle, um, and just cut around the wig cap. Um, don't pull just because you're going to start to pull it off your head, but just make sure it's dry beforehand. Um, and then, you know, just cut the access cap off. This is the hair. I love Organique. Like, Organique has the best synthetic hair. All right, so next, I'm just going to measure, uh, measure, <laughs> measure each track. And I want to make sure I'm pulling it up above my ears on both sides. Um, on both sides. Because if I don't do that, the sides of my hair is going to show. If you guys can understand what I'm saying. You just want to make sure it's going in an upward motion so when it's you know out you can't see the sides but yeah i go ahead and apply the glue and i do this one by one um just because sometimes i can't like apply it when the track is like super super long so i have to cut it um but yeah i go ahead and just apply the glue and then lay the track making sure it's low enough because i honestly had to go back in and add a track underneath because it wasn't low enough so just you know put it low enough to your liking but yeah this is me halfway done i don't want to say halfway but a few tracks in um look how flowy it is look how full that's another reason why i use two different types of curls and honestly i really wasn't mad at the store not having it because it came out really really nice um and full because i like the full and flowy look y'all i love it already like i was so pressed <laughs> and i wasn't even done <laughs> it looks so nice though but now i'm moving on to the front um i'm gonna go ahead and i was debating on doing two but then i ended up just doing one because y'all have a big head and like two just didn't look really nice on me i don't know i didn't really like the two ponytails so we're just gonna do one um but as you can see like where the cap is showing that's what i was talking about i had to go back in and add a track um but yeah i go ahead and section my ponytail off take my edges out um and then i'm gonna start to mold my ponytail with the got to be spray another look y'all because it looks so nice it looks so nice ah. okay so the got to be spray i spray it a little bit as i go and then i'll blow dry which this is my first time ever doing this method um because i normally would put it on a ponytail and then try to smooth it and it wouldn't work so i spray a little bit blow dry a little bit you know mold it brush it and yeah it was starting to hold its form in the ponytail as you can see i got it in the ponytail and i go in with my even or even uh, edge control and i apply just a little bit just because this does get white and then you can see i go back to the blow dryer because you need to blow dry <laughs> so it can hold and stay in place I did not get to record me putting my ponytail on because I was so frustrated, y'all. I did not like how it came out. But I still had to get this video out to you guys. So, yeah, this is just me wrapping the base of the ponytail. Um, just trying to cover, you know, the tracks, any tracks that are showing at the base of the ponytail.
After doing my edges, I did go ahead and let the wrap, the edge wrap sit on my um, head for a little bit just so they could set and y'all. Ah, it looks so nice. Like, OMG, OMG. Ah, okay, so I just go ahead and brush it out just because I needed to like detangle it and stuff like that. I didn't brush it out, you know, throughout the process. But all right, y'all. So this is how it came out. Um, I may end up doing the ponytail different. This is it's been a while since I've actually did this though. So, but this time it actually came out really nice. Um, let me back it up for you guys. Yeah, it's like really fluffy. I did end up using two different socks of hair. Um, just because I already had. Okay, so I already had this hair. And I had this, I was supposed to do this hair or put this hair in like a couple of months ago. So I had already had two packs. So I had to go and get two more packs, but the only thing I had closest to this one was that. So as you can see, they're kind of similar, but y'all, it's like super fluffy. Like, I love it. If you guys can see, it's like really cool. Y'all, it came out so cute. Like, it came out so cute. I'm super excited with the results. Like, y'all. But yeah, y'all, that is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. Well, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to turn on my post notifications so you guys don't miss a video. All right, y'all, let me know in the comments how I did. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Bye. That be a passion. Mm -hmm.